My name is Darian Borello, and I invite you to come train back with me today as I train for the 2018 Fitness Olympia. Right now, we are at Iron Factory Gym in Washington, PA, owned by IFBB Pro Dave Grotta. Today, we are going to be training back. I train back one day a week to really focus on creating that V taper that is really important to create your overall body structure on stage. The larger you can make your shoulders and the wider you can make your back, the smaller you make that waist look. I genetically do not have a very tiny waist. I have a very athletic core. So back training is huge for me and it's really important for me to try to make my lats as big as I can to appear like I have a tiny waist on stage. We are very heavily judged on the symmetry of our body and the overall structure and what they call that X factor. So it's big shoulders and back to a tiny waist to then big legs, creating an X shape from about shoulder to knee. So when every girl is lined up in a row, they're looking at proportionately how everyone's waist looks compared to their shoulders, their legs. So it's huge to make sure you're really training your back, you're really making it wide, you're making it developed all the way through. First thing I do when I get in here, drop my bag, say hi to the dogs, and then I mix my pre-workout. Today, my pre-workout has Rainbow Candy Total War, Tiger's Blood Grunt, and Kiwi Strawberry Mob. Total War is a pre-workout. It helps to not only give you energy through your workouts, but get blood really pumping to your muscles. Grunt is your essential amino acids. Those are incredibly important while you work out because as you're breaking down the muscle, the essential amino acids are able to replenish and help you to build the muscle. And then MOB, which is the mother of all builders, is an extremely high leucine content product. Very large doses of leucine while working out can increase overall muscular development. I typically work out a singular body part for about 30 minutes. I tend to push the intensity the whole time. I don't like to make it go longer than that. I feel beyond that amount of time, I'm not able to really push myself quite as hard. I usually work five to six exercises, three to four sets per exercise. My husband, Aaron, actually writes all of my lifting workouts, so sometimes he tortures me, sometimes he's a little nicer. It just depends on what we're going for, but we're always looking to create a balanced physique and a balanced back and hit all areas of my back equally. I naturally enjoy pushing myself. So a sport like bodybuilding and even gymnastics in the past resonates huge with me because it's all about how hard I push myself. There's no defense to a sport like this. It's just offense, it's just what you bring to the gym, how hard you work and what you're willing to put into it to me directly correlates to what you produce on the stage and what you're able to show off. Days I'm struggling, diet-wise, workout-wise, I'm just tired. Um, I look within myself for motivation, but I really try to just tell myself to leave no stone unturned. You know, every meal, every rep, every cardio session is one more step to get to what my goal is. And right now the goal is the Fitness Olympia. So that is really what motivates me day in and day out. I want to bring the best version of myself that any stage has ever seen, and that requires me to keep pushing myself every day through every workout, every cardio session, every meal.